here the question is why are the medicines more effective in colloidal state medicines are often more effective in colloidal state because of several reasons the first and important reason is the increased surface area colloidal particles have a large surface area relative to their volume this increased surface area allows for better interaction between the medicine and the biological tissues leading to more effective absorption and action the second one is enhanced bioavailability the small size of colloidal particles can facilitate their penetration through the biological membranes and improves the bioavailability of the medicine the third one is controlled release colloidal systems can provide controlled and sustained release of the medication over time which can enhance the therapeutic efficiency and reduce the frequency of dosing coming to the old question here we need to differentiate between the emulsion and a gel an emulsion is a colloidal system in which one liquid is dispersed in other immiscible liquid usually with the help of an emulsifying agent and the common types include oil in water and water in oil emulsions and the examples include butter and mayonnaise these emulsions typically consist of liquid droplets dispersed throughout the another liquid and they can be stable or unstable depending on the formulation and conditions whereas gel is a colloidal system where a liquid is dispersed in a solid or semi solid matrix it forms a network that traps the liquid and giving the gel its structure gels are more solid like compared to emulsions the examples includes gelatin deserts and aloe vera gel these gels have a more rigid structure compared to the emulsions and can retain their shape while still containing a significant amount of liquid so the key differences is that emulsions involve two immiscible liquids and are generally fluid while gels involve a liquid dispersed in a semi solid matrix and have a more gel like consistency